Laundry. So you saw me hanging out that t-shirt uh, while I was uh, sorting my laundry. Now that t-shirt has a long story. Um, that goes back to 2004, 2003, uh, which was a time where I was involved quite heavily in the fight against software patents in Europe. I found a group here in Munich, uh, well effectively they were all over Europe, uh, called the FFII, the Foundation for a Free Information Infrastructure. I think I'm still a member of the organization, I'm still paying for that. Um, and they were focal point of the opposition against software patents. They did a lot of actions and, and weird things. So we discussed here in Munich, let's go to Linux Tag in Karlsruhe, uh, which at that time was the biggest event uh, for Linux in uh, Germany for sure. And let's organize a demonstration there uh, against software patents, which we did. Uh, so I talked to the police, I talked to the organizers of Linux Tag who were not really happy in the beginning, uh, but ultimately they ended up using the footage of the demonstration to promote their own event, so I guess they liked it after all. And uh, we started planning for everything. Now, planning a demonstration is quite a lot of work. I organized a truck, I organized PA, um, organized the speakers, all of the permissions. Uh, we turned up with uh, around about a thousand people. Some say it was 1,200, some say it was 800. I don't really know what the exact number is. And it was the biggest demonstration against software patents in Europe. It was it was two or three days before the Linux talk started. So. You know, people were telling me, hey, we need to make t-shirts. So I went out into the garden, I, I took a selfie uh, in front of, of whatever kind of metal structure that looked a little bit like prison bars. With the GIMP I, I manipulated it so it looked even worse. So that's the front of the t-shirt, that's actually me um, behind bars. <laughs> I think that's a nice idea for some people and a nice thing to think about. Jan Wildeboer behind bars which almost happened in Switzerland, but that's a story for another episode. So I made this t-shirt with no software patents on the back. We made 1200 t-shirts. They were printed in Belgium um, and brought to Karlsruhe at the very last minute. And, and we effectively, we sold all of them uh, on the first day of Linux Tag. So that's the story behind that t-shirt that I still have. I, I think I have two or three of them.